You may start approach upon completion of fly around. We copy. So at this point, the Soyuz in that station keeping period, waiting for the uh, go for final approach. We have indicator mode. How copy? We copy. Keeping. We are MRM2. Uh, and video resumed. And uh, can you confirm we are at eclipse right now? That will be in seven minutes. You can turn on the floodlight. Uh, it's in. So we issue command for approach. Yes, 0354. Copy, and we'll be at the approach mode. We got it. Issued. So at 8.23, the go for final approach given. Velocity, 190. So use craft in view from the International Space Station on its final approach towards the Poisk module. Fidalka, Kelly, and Kornienko inside, about 160 meters away. One sixty range, point six range rate. The crew started their final approach uh, just about a minute or so ahead of their timeline, so that docking might occur a little bit before 8.36, uh, but that the uh, intended target time for this Soyuz craft to dock to the Poise module. But again, they are at this point on final approach. Uh, the core's uh, automated rendezvous system engaged. Just about uh, five or six minutes before docking, uh, the core's antenna is going to be retracted or retracted, that'll come uh, when the uh, Soyuz is roughly about 41 meters away from its final docking port. Tally ho. One fifteen. Point seven. A quick tally ho from Scott Kelly, the NASA astronaut on board. All three crew members, veteran space flyers, uh, each having done at least one long duration expedition on board. Copy. Under 100 meters away now. Continuing to close in, you can see Poise uh, right there in the center of your view. Also known as the Mini Research Module 2, it's the docking port that this vehicle is going to be attached to. Once they dock, uh, hooks will uh, be able to close uh, on both the Soyuz uh, and the uh, Poisk module. 85 meters, point 38. Range, range rate, point 38. Watching the target. Again, that range rate's going to continue to shrink down a little bit smaller and smaller as they close in. Should be around a tenth of a meter per second right as they're getting ready to dock. Coming up on 75 meters away. Copy. 75 meters passing. Inaudible. Good view there of the uh, Soyuz TMA-16M spacecraft. Passing 70 meters. Uh, 
50 meters. So use continuing to close in, closing at uh, under two tenths of a meter per second at this point. Just about to cross uh, the 40 meter threshold. Uh, again at 41 meters, uh, that core's antenna should be retracting. Viewer, it's done. And then turn it back on, and then uh, re. Another great view of the Soyuz, the station's robotic arm, Canada Arm 2, there in the foreground. Soyuz passing behind. Anton is closed. Anton, how copy? Solar rays, beautiful. And getting confirmation the core's antenna has been retracted. That's why I didn't respond. Copy. Thirty-five meters, zero point one five range rate. Uh, the and vehicle the image is stable. Back. No and issues. I'm going Copy to start recording again. Copy. Thank you. Thirty meters is the rate. Rate and the range rate 0 0.14 meters per second. And just 25 more meters to go. 25 meters is the range, and the range rate is uh, 0 0.14. Range 20, range rate 0.11. So the rate of... Uh Closure and the distance between the two vehicles now right at around a tenth of a meter per second. Range Coming up on just 20 meters, meters away, you can see Poisk on the docking the target there uh, in the center of your view. The target uh, is a little bit uh, far from uh, from the center, but it's within the limits. It is nominal. So we have the alignment on in row, and the target is moving to the center. The target is in the center. So the crosshairs are stable on the target. 
скоро ще започна. Копи. So, uh, point 11 is the uh, range rate and it is safe. Soyuz craft about to get up close and personal with the Poisk module just about 10 meters away. We are observing the contact. The target will be standing by for docking confirmation under 10 meters away. Fine. Coming up on five meters. Inaudible. So there is mechanical contact. Everything is fine. Okay, the guys, congratulations. And contact and capture confirmed. The one year crew has arrived. And uh, coming at 8.33. PM Central Time, 8.33 and 41 seconds if you want to get exact. While both vehicles were flying just about 252 statute miles just off the uh, western coast of Colombia.